Yo guys, what is up? Icy Gamers here. Today, this video is for you if you can't get Cosmic Client to work. I've had a few people that have been able to help them. It's only for Windows though, so if you have a Mac, then I guess you gotta look for this video at least. But yeah, so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure you have Java. So step one, install Java, or make sure you have the newest version of Java installed. Oh yeah, right here. Install Java or make sure you have the newest version of Java installed, so that should be decently easy to do. I already have the newest version of Java installed, so I'm not going to show it here. Or me installing it, because it would take me a little bit. Alright, we have to make sure that when we install the .jar file that it's going to be a file that looks like this. Because it could be, or not, not like Photoshop, like this right here. Because this is what this is what you want it to look like at the end, but it could look like something like this right here, which it would be you don't want it to look like that. So we're gonna go down to Control Panel, or or you would might not even be able to open it, which is what I was having problems with early on, like an Internet Explorer. So this is so yeah, you make sure you have Java installed first. I couldn't find any videos. I tried to look for it, but I had to find a different video that wasn't even Cosmic Client to find this. So you go to programs, you don't go to Java, you go to default programs. Then you go associate a file type or protocol with a program. So right there, number two. I have like a links for all these and um, steps in the description. So you gotta wait for okay. Then you go to choose app or choose default apps by file type. So this is gonna take a little bit to load. All right, so once you get the choose default apps by file type to load up, you're going to see the left side right here where this the file types are, and you'll see the right side of the app. So you're going to go all the way down till you see dot jar. So you start with the A's. You can probably scroll down faster if you do the sidebar. So dot J. And all right, so here's I, or is that that's L? My <laughs> here we go. I saw J somewhere. Yes, yeah, so go up to you see dot jar, which is right here. It could be. These are the options that I had, which were, I think one of them was Internet Explorer, and it was on WinRAR another time. But you should, once you have the newest version of Java installed, you should be able to choose Java TM Platform SE Binary. So choose this one right here. And then, if you can't open it, if you can't, or yeah, so, alright, yeah. Then, once you have that done, you go to Cosmic Client, and then you hit Download. So I'll just hit Download, I guess. You want to hit keep. Should be fine. You might have to turn off your antivirus, but I don't think you do. Then you hit open. And it'll open it. But. It might not open it. So if that's the case. Then you're going to go to jar fix. You sh it should have something installed like this on your desktop or it wherever you install it at. So yeah, but if you can't get this to open, like, oh yeah, and you want to click the launcher one, you don't want to click click the constant client one because this one won't open anything, but the launcher one will. If you can't get the launcher to open though, then you're gonna go to jar fix. This is the other way that. I've helped some people get Cosmic Client to download. 
So you're going to click free window or free download for Windows. No thanks. Continue to download Jarfix right here. Then you wait for it. It's going to ask you to, you don't have to sign in right here. You can just click the alternative download. And then it's right here. So you're just going to click on it right here. And it's going to, it's a .exe, so it'll run itself. I'm pretty sure that's what a .exe is, but, or that's how you, it opens when you click it. So you're just going to click open. You don't need to click show notifications though. So yes. So this is going to show up. You're going to hit yes. And then you'll get this. The Dart has been registered successfully. Jar package Java applications can be executed again by double click. So you, this means that you can now you want to re-click the launcher and then it should work. If it doesn't work, then you can comment down below and I'll see if I could figure it out. But this should be it for this video. Hope this, this was helpful to you guys. I'll have all the links and the steps in the description. 